Welcome to another video on this channel. The other week I was thinking about what video I wanted to do for this week on this channel and I was thinking about the fact that finals week is next week. I literally have my last day of school in a few days. What? And it got me thinking all of the expectations that I always build up inside of me for the last day of school. You know the last day of school you think it's going to be so perfect and you think that all your friends are just gonna have a big hug session and love each other and it's gonna be hot and sunny outside and your yearbooks are gonna be signed all the way up, filled to the top, whatever that means, go with it. But as I'm getting older, I'm realizing that the last day of school is more sweats, tank tops, and finals. Not fun. So for today's video, I thought that I would do expectations versus reality of the last day of school because, uh, let me tell you, I have some expectations built up every year and they never happen. Also, if you like any of the clothes that I wear in this video, then you can find them exclusively at Kohl's. They're from the So Rad collection from Austin is TV and you guys know that I've done two other videos with their clothes because they're freaking awesome. So yeah, if you like any of the clothes in this video, then be sure to find them at Kohl's. So without further ado, grab your summer bikinis because let's get started. That, that one didn't work. Let's go. <laughs> I love you. First things first is yearbooks. Um, Andrew, will you sign my yearbook? Every year I'm let down by the people that I love the most when I ask them to write in my yearbook. Um, Andrew, will you sign my yearbook? Thanks, thank you. Next up is throwing your papers into the air, which every movie that shows the last day of school seems to put in. You ain't on my swag. You ain't you ain't on my swag. You ain't on my swag. On my swag, swag radar. You ain't on my swag. You ain't you ain't on my swag. You ain't on my swag. On my swag. swag. probably gonna get in trouble for that. Hey! That's littering! Pick those up! Okay! <laughs> now the one thing that I always look forward to on the last day of school is having a free day in class. Oh my gosh, guys, so Marik is right around the corner. Like, you know, it's, we're here, here's the corner, it's there. Oh, it's right. I know, right? Like, hey, Martha, have you signed this yearbook? Can I use your pen? Go ahead, take it. Anybody need their yearbook signed? Hey, have you signed my yearbook yet? Oh, yeah, let me know! She means that costs like $90. Your mom costs like $90. Older, I'm sorry to say, the last week of school turns into finals week. All right, class, pencils down in 15 minutes. You got 15 minutes, and then you're out for summer break. Psst. What? This is stupid. You're stupid. Take your test. Wait, what'd you get for four? 22. Summer break. 
Cheater! Che cheating! She's cheating! Cheating! Give her zero! Cheater! Che cheater! The next expectation is having your last day of school on a perfect sunny summer day where everyone is buzzing and ready to get out of school. Not everybody lives in a climate that is sunny all the time. And some days your last day of school goes like this. Ava, what are you doing outside? There's a tornado warning coming in. You gotta get in class and stay warm. Having the perfect last day of school outfit. I thought that I would show you three outfits that I would wear on the last day of school. So this first outfit is something that I would totally wear for the last day of school because number one, it's super comfortable. Number two, it's super breezy for that California weather. And number three, it's adorable. Usually for the last day of school, I like to wear a bathing suit underneath my clothes because it makes me feel like summer and a lot of my friends do it too. And then after school, we go to the beach or we go to the pool. This dress is so easy to throw on and throw off at the pool and I'm wearing a pink backpack to add some color to the outfit and then just some boots. The second outfit is totally summery and it's a romper. Now rompers are perfect because they are so comfortable and easy to throw on and especially if you have finals last day of school, this will just be so comfortable to sit in class with. Since it's black, I decided to pair a floral headband and I thought it added the perfect amount of color to this outfit. and totally flower power. I think this is my favorite outfit out of the three. Now if you want a little bit more color into your outfit, then for the third outfit I decided to go with this patterned dress and it's kind of similar to the first dress except this one has a lot more going on with it. It's going to be super cute in pictures. I feel like this is totally Coachella, like I could go from school straight to a music festival with this outfit. If you like any of these outfits, then you can get them from the So Rad line available at Kohl's. And if you get any of them, show me your pictures with the hashtag So Rad. The reality is, when it's finals week, you probably will not be thinking about your last day of school outfit. is having these amazing first day of summer plans. I used to stress so much about what I was gonna do the first day of summer or like the first night of summer when you get out of school. And usually your expectation goes like this in your head.
Leave with Simone. Take her home to New York. Why would you think I'd want? And funny. I met her yesterday. Successful. You love her writing. She's your age. I, I can't compete. Dance with her and hold her hand in front of other people. <laughs> So that was this video, and I hope you guys enjoyed this expectations versus reality video of the last day of school. If you found yourself laughing or relating to anything in this video whatsoever, be sure to smash that like button with your thumb. Literally take your thumb and just smash it. Smash. Also be sure to go and follow me on my Instagram and Twitter and I tweet some funny stuff. I, I mean, I would like to think that I tweet some cool stuff. So that is it for this video. I love you guys so, so much. Um, let me know in the comments down below when you get out of school or if you're already out, in which case then you're so lucky. I love you so much. If I didn't say that already, I can't say it enough. I love you. Have a great, amazing day. I hope that you guys are all super happy today. And if you're not happy, then get happy. Oh yeah. I love you guys and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.